Hi, this is P. Sandy. I just thought that maybe today I could do something I wanted to see on the internet and I thought, well, maybe what I'll do. Yeah, I was just gonna do what I thought of. So anyway, I just thought, you know what? I'd like to watch somebody do something. So I thought, well, I'll do it myself. Oh my goodness. So here we are. This is what I gotta do. I'm gonna fold all this laundry. I'm gonna, no, I'm ironing my laundry on camera. If I can get the cameras on a good angle. There. Okay, so here we go. This is funny. Oh my goodness. I'm, I'm gonna iron my clothes on camera and fold them <laughs> and then put them on the chair beside me. And then when I'm done folding them, after I iron them, I'm going to put them back in the basket. So I just thought this would be a great opportunity. And I don't have an iron board, an ironing board, so I just thought maybe somebody would like to see this. Okay, let me explain to you how I'm getting this done. I couldn't find, I didn't find an ironing board. I found one at the store, but then I didn't have room in my car for an ironing board. So, I said, what am I going to do? How am I going to iron my clothes? You know what I mean? Like, how am I going to iron my clothes? And I'm like, okay, you know what I'll do is I will put it on the freezer, on the deep freezer, put a towel over top of the deep freezer. And then I will iron my clothes. Yeah. So I really wanted to iron my clothes. And if you guys iron your clothes at home and have any suggestions for me, like, okay, so I did one side. And I'm thinking, I'm going to do the other side too, right? But if you have a suggestion, like... Well, I think I would stick to this, doing one side and then the other. But if you have a suggestion for me, about just like... Maybe getting... Maybe... Maybe I don't have to iron both sides, but... I don't know what you guys, what other people are doing, like, probably, that's why the ironing board has a lip on it, so you can fit it up over and around it, eh? I think that's how it works. But this is how I'm doing it, so, it's nice to get it done. I know, it's so... It's so complicated. So if you guys want, if you guys uh, want to iron along with me, you can. And we'll do this together. See? It's all ironed. Now I fold, fold it. Oh! My ironing, my um, washer machine broke. So, I'm gonna, recycle it. I'm gonna recycle it and then I'm giving it to a company that's gonna recycle it and then I'm gonna get a new one that works. I wish I could cut it got it fixed but uh, it's hard to find a company that will do that 
Oh. Like, I want, I want one that's reliable, eh? Anyway, my washer machine was 20 years old, so I'm gonna get a new one. <laughs> Maybe 23 years old, because the guy that gave it to me, he said, he said that, yeah, he said he fixes washing machines and that he would deliver it to me for the for a price like fifty dollars to deliver both machines he gave me both machines I didn't have a washer or a dryer at all so he gave me both machines he gave me both machines and uh I hope you guys can see this somewhat. I know it's like maybe give you a different angle or something. So I paid about four hundred dollars plus delivery. So I think it came to about $400 total. And this guy, he, all he does is he fixes washing machines and then delivers them to people. But I wanted, I wanted to buy from him again, but I couldn't find him on Kijiji. And it's been three years since I know he last did it. Um, I don't know how long he's been doing it for, so I didn't know if I could get, find him. I didn't know if I could find him on um, Yeah, I didn't know if I could find him again, but I, tr I like I tried to find him, but couldn't see him anywhere on Kijiji. So I don't know if he moved or not doing it anymore. First, I'm like, well, if I can't get my washing machine going right away, well, I wait for, I didn't know what to do to get a washer machine or what. So, I brought, and it's like, I have, like, I'm always busy doing fishing or whatever. Or, it's hard to make time for, I don't know. Okay, you guys tell me if I did any repeats. <laughs> if I like, if I like did this shirt maybe twice, I don't know. I think this is my last sleeve and then I'm gonna go to the next. But I wasn't really sure if I flipped it, flipped it, and then flipped it one more time. <laughs> Cause Anyway, yeah, <laughs> so I got this lady at a laundromat to do my clothes. And here I'm thinking, oh, that should be only one or two loads. No, I, th I was thinking it's like one load or two, I forget now. But what she does is she'll wash her clothes and fold it. She'll wash and fold your clothes. She does a really good job folding too. I, was re I really like that. And uh, so I got her to wash my clothes. Got her to wash my clothes. And fold it and she did a really good job. And I was really super impressed. 
and she said it would be no more than maybe thirty-four dollars. I'm like, whoa, whoa, whoa! You said eight fifty a load, and I didn't. And she's thinking, well, maybe it's four loads, and I'm like, oh, I didn't even expect that. I wouldn't have gone. I don't think I would have went there if I would have known thirty. Four dollars to wash my laundry. I think I would have went or my mom's washing machine and then bring it home and dry it because I have my dryer still working. season and I guess these Yes, it's it's June, I think 29th or, or 30th. It's the last day of June. So and I don't know how that lady got my clothes so flat. Like it, it seemed like the clothes were flat. I'm like Fold it. I don't know. She folded it so flat. I mean, so I'm gonna look at my camera while I'm doing this. And see if you can see me. So that's one leg. I think it helps not to have so many wrinkles. Looks a lot better. I think the I think wrinkles in clothes is a little like hard. But 
I need to, I need to iron these because I didn't fold them right away. This side looks good. Looks like I did two in one. <laughs> So if you watch this, let me know if you think I should do any more videos on me just cleaning stuff or doing household duties. <laughs> Maybe we can sh share like tips and stuff, like you could, if you watch this, maybe you could say, you know what, this really helps me, and how do you work your daily tasks? I don't know, I gotta see, oh I gotta put more water in it, okay. More, more water in the iron. For sure. This is great. And clothes holding. Got some water right here. Yeah. Oh, I'll let you see the new clothes in the iron. Can you see that? I don't know. I have to pull it, pour it really slow. Because it's a small hole and the bubbles need to come out. Come out bubbles. See? Come out bubbles. Can you see that? The bubbles coming out. Oh my goodness. A slowpoke monkey. <sighs> How do you get the bubbles to go out faster? There. Is it full yet? It's half full. Okay, I'll just pour slower. See? Just pour slower. Boy. Pour. Pour slower. So that the bubbles can come out easier. Let's see if it's full. Oh, just a tiny bit more. There, that should be good. Alrighty, I'm gonna put a little bit more water in, in the cup for next time. Put it back over here. Put you over here. for my washing machine. The only thing I gotta tell you about this washing machine is I got it from Home Depot. And the only thing about it is it's really big. Like it fits a lot in it. But um, the thing about it is I ordered it and they said they'd bring it in on Tuesday. Then this lady calls me. I can't understand her. And now I'm freaking out because I have no idea what she said about it. Other than they're not bringing it. I'm like, what? You're not going to give me my washing machine? Like, I'm paying for it. It scared me. But I think they just said that they did, they're waiting for the delivery of the washing machine. And then, and then they're going to, um, yeah, they're waiting for the delivery of the washing machine. 
the way you can deliver the washing machine. Oh shit, I can't think. It's not working. It's like a, it's like a really weird pattern for the stitches. Like two stitches on, on one line, like a very separate line. It's harder to see the seam. There's no seams to fit. It's not good. See the lines? There's a line here and then there's a line here, so I don't know where the seam is. It's complicated. I don't know. I'm just like thinking that I don't remember what I'm doing. somebody to do this for me and that's why I'm doing it for you. I wanted somebody to show me how they work. So it's like Because when you watch like YouTube videos, what are they really doing? You know what I mean? It's like, can you please just show me you doing something? I really like that. But they just want to show you their house or something. It's like, so you're showing me the finished product. Show me your house after you clean it? Why can't I just see your house? while you're cleaning it. Right? Right. Because they're probably too embarrassed to the mess. I don't know. Like, I can't show my house looking like this. See why you gotta take the wrinkles out? Because they're really wrinkly. And you know how much it improves it? When you iron it? Like, really? It does. Okay. The scissors keep sticking. There we go. Other side, then the legs. The So just the legs this time. I did the front. Then I do the other side. Trying the camera. It's doing really good. It's just. Tell me what motivates you. What do you enjoy? You gotta tell me in the comments below. Okay, you gotta tell me all about your work. What do you do for? How does it make you feel when you 
feel something when you're cleaning. Like, does it make you feel good to clean? Maybe it's hard to start sometimes. I don't know. Maybe it's easy to start. Maybe you're just pro. Maybe you're the pro. Maybe you're the pro. So, I like that. Maybe you're the pro. It sounds good. I like that. I'll just do the one side. Then the other side. I don't know. Maybe this. my skin. How the heck can you do this? I don't know. But I will try. I will try to do my hidden part. There we go. That's better. Now, I did the front, so I gotta do it. My goodness, I dropped you. My goodness, my goodness, my goodness. I don't know how that happened. Oh, this item is just so big, that's why it's it hit it. Hit the phone. Okay. Alrighty. Let's continue. There we go. So I just thought this would be my experiment to see how old people think of people cleaning. Because I know there's this one lady. I love to watch her. Because she'll make things or like rest like she'll make um she made all she makes like I don't know, popcorn. She takes a lamb, takes its fur, I suppose, and she takes the lamb's fur, and she takes it, and she washes it. No, she takes all, she combs it first, right? Well, it's off the lamb. She takes, combs it, takes all the little dirt out. Then she washes it. Then she wa then she dries it. And then she washes it again to make it into like she and she dries it over the fire, which I think is pretty cool. She washes it over the fire. I just love her videos because they're really musical. They're really, really musical. You know what? Even if you can't see everything I'm doing, I like doing this in front of you guys, if you're still, if you're really watching me. Because I have another channel where I blow up balloons. Another channel where I blow up balloons. And people seem to really like it. Because I started, well, when I started about maybe three months, three, four months ago with blowing up balloons. People really love that. And, uh, 
I just thought my other channel, maybe I'll just dedicate it to, I don't know, whatever comes to mind. So, I'm going to crease right here. So I'm going to do one extra in the middle. There we go. Did I forget to do the back? I don't know. The pockets? There we go. You know what's really cool about having the, what about ironing my clothes on the on this? It's like hip level, so it's really much easier to do. It's like so much easier to do this standing up. I'm like, what's... That's why I picked here because I, I'm like, well, what's, what's like an iron board like level wise? Like, I got it. My deep freezer. Because I could have got an iron board for 10 bucks, but what do you put in my car? <laughs> but look, I got my deep freezer, so I don't really need an iron board. I might have to cut this short. No, I think I should finish. I'm almost done, I think. I just want to finish it up. Oops. Yeah. Just gotta finish it. That's part of the job is finishing. No more mining. Jelly bang. Did I do the back side? I think I didn't. Oh goodness, this is good exercise for anybody who wants to do this. It's great exercise. Like, I woke up, I cleaned my bathroom. Right? And then uh, I went for a run. <laughs> I actually did run today because I'm like, Come back, you forgot your shirt. I found it. Oh, good. But yeah. But yeah, so I did run for like maybe 